Weighing the Food Safety Certification Option What is Food Safety Certification? Food Safety Certification is typically a voluntary certification program established to ensure that food manufacturers follow certain standards and requirements in the food industry. The purpose is to keep consumer safety and food distribution practices safe. Common food safety certifications include the Basic Good Manufacturing Practices GMP, Hatched Certification. Globally recognized food safety initiative schemes include the Safe Quality Food Certification, BRC Certification, FSSC 22000 Certification, Primus GFS, Canada GAP, etc. Do you need food safety certification? Perhaps the most important question that you have is do you need a food safety certification? If you are looking at expanding your market, you should consider getting ready for a food safety certification audit. Food safety certification now or later. Even if you are not looking towards a food safety certification, we highly recommend that you have a working food safety management system. Food safety management systems help with Keeping your food safe, reduce withdrawal slash recall build a food safety culture, smooth food operations ensure you meet regulatory requirements. Build consumer trust What and how to choose food safety certification? Not all food safety certifications are equal. The best way to choose food safety certification is to choose the one that works best for you and your customers. The question is, what works best for you? How do I get started? The first step to food safety certification is to build and implement a food safety management system. Here are the few steps that you must take to build and implement your food safety management system. Build basic GMP and hack programs fundamental regardless of what C scheme you choose. Build standard operating procedures SOP, for each GMP and hack element use in-house food safety experts or food safety consultants. Use our SFPM template to build an SOP that meets GMP and hack expectations. Implement the GMP and HACP programs through employee training, monitoring and verification. Choose your PSI scheme based on your needs and customer requirements. Add additional PSI requirements about your chosen scheme. Repeat the program development and implement above. Maintain food safety programs that you develop. Have record to proof that you meet the requirements. If you are new to this, we recommend you choose a PSI scheme rather than building it at a later stage because it takes more work for the review and implementation stage. Especially to inform and train employees about the changes when they are already used to the basic GMP and HACP requirements. Besides, not many upgrades needed to go from HACP requirements to PSI requirements.